From robots to bridges, it's all things STEM. And one organization is setting kids up with the tools for success through afternoon programs, homeschool, even birthday parties. And 17's Mary Kay Paquette joins us this morning to tell us a little bit more about this. Good morning. Good morning, you guys. I'm so excited. This program is really cool. It's giving kids all over, whether you're in, you're learning it in school or not, access to STEM-related activities and all of that fun yeah. stuff, even on birthday parties. It's really cool. Take a look. This is Engineering for Kids. It's fun, and we get to build a lot, and um, we get a program, and... A bunch of other stuff. The company, started in 2009 by an engineering teacher in Virginia, franchised in 2011. In 2014, Tondra and Mac Hunter bought into it, bringing the program to Kern County to provide STEM, science, technology, engineering, and math activities for pre-K through 8th graders. We kids exposed to stuff earlier in life because their minds like little sponges, and they soak up more. When they are exposed early to stuff like STEM, they are more likely to pursue a career in STEM. Coding to robotics to engineering bridges. The goal, to inspire the next generation of engineers. To see little kids be able to expose them to, to science and technology and engineering and them getting the concept. Um, it, it's just great. The kids ask the question, they brainstorm the de design, they uh, build the product, they test it out and they improve it. From after school and homeschool groups to birthday parties and summer camps, the curriculum written by real engineers meets national and state STEM education standards. Fourth grader Jaden Wright joined the homeschool group a year and a half ago. Right now we're making our robot do stuff on the mat. We have to program it on the computer and then we plug it into the cord and then the cord will send all the data to the robot and then we'll um, test it and then we'll do it again and again and again. Right, getting hands-on experience with all things STEM but learning perhaps the most important lesson, teamwork. I love the the program and how it builds the relationships with the kids, how it's using the teamwork and having the kids really take ownership of the projects that they're making and letting them see the mistakes. They have to test the things out and they make those mistakes and they have to redo it, figure it out and make it work and then you see them light up when they um, have figured it out and that's amazing. Right now, Engineering for Kids is traveling around using space to space, but they're hoping to have a permanent brick and mortar uh, come January-ish. So yeah. that's great. Yeah, you know, it's really neat to see these students, uh, you know, have a hands-on experience with this. You know, sometimes they learn about it in school, they read about it, but now they're able to kind of dive in and. I'm listening to what some of these kids were saying, and I'm like, that's way over my head for sure. No, yesterday <laughs> when I was there getting all the video, I was like, these kids are so much smarter than I was oh, at yeah. this age. Like, I, I couldn't even, I, I, can't, I can't code, I can't do no. any of that. Although you look back at what you were doing at that age, yeah. and I'm like, oh, yeah. okay. okay. It's yeah. crazy it's how technology is, is kind of taking over, oh, yeah. and these yeah. kids, they're going to be the pioneers of it all, and right. so it's, it's so important for them to learn so young. So cool. Thanks, yeah. Mary Kate.